Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we will configure Metasploitable 2 in VMware. So first uh, we have to download Metasploitable 2. So start your Google, just search for Metasploitable 2 and you will get a couple of links. So let's search for Metasploitable 2 and uh, okay there are links. So uh, you have this Rapid7 link and you have this Wallhub link as well. So let's download it from Wallhub. So there are a few download links, so let's go with uh, mirror, let's click on the mirror and download it. It will take like couple of minutes to download and this is a very straightforward process, you don't have to do anything else. So I'll pause this video for a while while it is downloading, I uh, will back. Okay, so we have downloaded the Metasploitable 2, it is a zipped file, so let's unzip it first and uh, I'll be unzipping it in a folder on my desktop so let's uh, extract all in the same folder okay so it is extracted now what we have to do is we have to open it up and we will see there is a configuration file uh, which we have to open with VMware it automatically takes up all the configuration from a uh, from a virtual machine perspective and it automatically opens up okay so you don't have to do any other configuration just have to click on that file so it, it will take like couple of minutes maybe one or two minutes and after it uh, it will be ready to you know be used okay so it has extracted now so you see um, the configuration file so just right click over there and open it with VMware and your machine will boot up it will do all the configuration by its own the default id and the default username and password is msf admin and msf admin so just right click open with vmware and uh, uh, just wait for it now it's opening okay so it will start configuring itself uh, i moved it uh, i generally select i moved it okay so now it is booting up and you can see uh, it automatically creates of files and folders required for its configuration and it will boot up in a sec okay so it's about to complete okay it's done as uh, we know default username and password is msf admin and msf admin and there we go that's all thank you for watching have a good day